Today I'm going to explain to you the PS4 remote play problem. So if you look at the screen right now, I'm logged in into my PS4 remote play. It's working. See, everything. I can use my controller here wirelessly. Everything is good. But then, when I click X on my account, on my main account, it just freezes. And it gives me this problem which says the connection to the PS4 has been lost. So what we need to do here is basically create a new account on PS4 and then use that as the login primary account but then when we want to play we use our main secondary account so let me show you how we do it so first of all let's log in into let's create a new account so let's create a new account on the PlayStation which is right behind me okay so creating a new account I'm just gonna pause it here I'm gonna create a new account and then I'll continue after alright so I just created a new account on my PlayStation Network so now what we need to do is basically log in back to the application which is PS4 remote play and then go to preferences and then we sign out from our main account so sign out and then sign in into the account that we created right now okay so I'm just gonna sign in Great, so now we signed in, we click on start, close this, start, now we go click on register manually, and on the PlayStation, Skip all this stuff. Skip. Um, activate as your primary. Okay. Okay. And then go to the settings. Okay. So when you register manually, you basically need to go to remote play connection setting and then click on add device and add in the number which is given to us on the PlayStation so basically 7 3, 3, register it's registering right now okay do it one more time add device register Two one six six three three four six three. Register and I should register now. Connecting. Great. So now we're in. Click on the click on the PS button so to log in and then basically now you can go into your account which is this is basically my main account click X and ta -da. it should not freeze right now okay that's it now I can basically play with no problems no lagging problems or no internet slow internet connection I don't know why it does that probably it's some some of the application or anything um, so I'll just show you that it works. So just to go back with you, basically all we have to do is create a new account. You can, you don't need any credit card or anything. You just sign in, create a new account, okay, and then make sure you sign out from the application itself. I'll just show you. So when you sign out, you go to System Preferences. Oh, I think I have to. Okay. 
here it is it's working and everything so all you have to do is sign out from the application itself and sign in into the new fake account that you're going to be creating and then when you sign in sign in to your main to your main account when you trying to play the game or when trying to use the ps4 remote play anyway that's basically it if you need any help just leave it in the comments and i'll make sure i'll get back to you peace